Hello and welcome to some Battlefield 4 gameplay playing Domination with the M... Uh, uh, one of the LMGs that you get. Well, I'll tell you in a second, I'll just look at what I've got. Yes, the... M249 LMG. Uh, with a suppressor. Uh, playing the support class, if you haven't already guessed. Today I'm going to be talking to you about why I think this idea that DICE owes the Battlefield community for the mess that Battlefield 4 was in is absolutely wrong. Um... Okay, I will admit that Battlefield 4, in the beginning, was pretty much unplayable. But they have been patching almost constantly and working on how to get the game in a playable state. And at the moment, for me, it is in a playable state. And I don't think they are going to screw it up with every single patch. I think what annoys me is that this community in Battlefield, the Battlefield community is turning into the Call of Duty community, which is a bad thing. The Call of Duty community is a bunch of kids. Now, I can't really say that there aren't kids playing Battlefield 4, and I don't blame them. It's a damn good game. It's, it's my, was my game of last year, even though I had it for only about barely a month. I'd still class it as my game of last year. Now, what I do find annoying is when people like Level Cap, who is a famous YouTuber in the Battlefield community, say, Dice owe us. Well, no, they don't. They got a product out that, okay, was substandard to begin with, but now it is in a playable state. Let's face it, unless you are in have something wrong with your computer, it should be reasonably playable. Okay, I've heard that the PS3 version has problems, but that that can be worked out. But most of the time, you can get a game in during you can get a couple of hours of gaming in. If you can't get a couple of hours of gaming in, then I'd uh, then I'd agree with you. But you can get a couple of hours of gaming in. I have got long sessions. And this is what annoys me. It, the people who shout the loudest are the people who have got enough time out of the game. People like Level Cap have pretty much, probably, already got 100 hours out of this game. I've got 79, for God's sakes. And it's been out for about three months. If you think about it. November, December... January. Yeah, about three months. Um, and it annoys me because the game is playable. It's not like Call of Duty Ghosts, which I have I have heard still is, in multiplayer, unplayable. The lag is ridiculous. Okay, there are lag issues with this game, but it's not as bad as Call of Duty Ghosts. I have been told that basically Call of Duty Ghosts is going to be the end of the Call of Duty franchise unless Treyarch get their ass in gear. Because Infinity, what's left of Infinity Ward fucked it up. But I cannot say that Battlefield 4 didn't have problems. But comparing it to Call of Duty Ghosts? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Call of Duty Ghosts is unplayable. This can be played by anyone. You can get a game. Now people say, but, but it doesn't work. I get kicked. Well, if you can get at least one hour of playing on a multiplayer map with your friends, I'd say it works. It has problems, but it works. 
what annoys me is people like Level Cap have these shows where they they they've been on for hours, and it's like, hang on, how did you get the footage if it doesn't work? If it's unplayable? If the net code is so bad you can't play it? Well, how did you get the show of where you you and his a mate of his are just mucking about on it? Okay, the net code isn't what. Well, the net code is better than Battlefield 3, let's face it. There are rare times that I've been shot round corners. Um, but I feel that Battlefield 4 is a good game. And I feel that DICE stopping all the other production of the DLC before they release the DLC, they want a working game. That is brilliant. That is superb. I don't... Yeah, this is a lag issue right here. Now, this is... I sometimes get lag issues. That isn't a bad thing. I... For the quality of the game, I don't feel that I've been let down. I would never ask for a refund for Battlefield 4. Battlefield 4 is brilliant, but I am so glad they have stopped production of DLC until they get the game in a playable state that they consider a playable state. I consider it in a playable state at the moment, but they don't. The DICE developers don't consider it in a playable state, and that is, frankly, is laudable for what they're doing and I don't think it was the community uproar that caused the problem I don't think the community uproar was it was a little bit of why they stopped development from the DLC now here's another thing that annoys me Level Cap has been saying recently that why haven't we got the second uh, the new expansion out well Excuse me, Level Cap. They've stopped production of the expansion so that they can get the game working. Yes, but it's on the Xbox One. Yeah, I don't care that it's on the Xbox One. They aren't getting China Rising yet till it's ready for them. We're not getting Second Assault yet until it's ready for the PC, PS3, PS4... PS, uh, that crowd of people. I don't think that this is a good way of acting. I think the community is sort of up in arms for no reason. And I personally feel it's deplorable. Now, I feel... I don't know. I personally feel that we should not be chastising DICE for the problems with Battlefield 4. EA is their publisher. Now EA has a track record of causing a lot of problems for publishers. And Let's face it, they'd cause problems for DICE with Battlefield 4. Um, one of the main problems I think they caused was basically the game came out a little too early. Now, is this a bad thing? No. Was it a disaster for DICE? Yes. Now, why wasn't it a bad thing if it was a disaster for DICE? Well... The game is out. Okay, people would class what we got as a beta test, and I would as well. We got what I would class as a beta test of a product. But, the product has been steadily increased in quality and performance over the past few month and a half, uh, around two months. It's been steadily increasing in quality, and nobody cannot say that it hasn't. 
I personally feel that people like Level Cap, who are complaining, should keep quiet. I feel that they are ill-advised to be complaining when they don't know how much work goes into making such a game such as Battlefield 4. They just go, I want my game fixed. Well, yeah, here's the problem. You've, they have got to go through tables and tables and tables. And they've got to go through files. They've got to go through many, many things to fix this game. Okay, it should have been a playable state to begin with. But it now is in a playable state. I don't think people should be complaining so much. Is the product 100% perfect? No. Is any product 100% perfect? No. I'd never class any game as 100% perfect. There are even one of my favorite games, which would be Master of Orion, there are problems. Uh, Master of Orion 2, to be precise. I, well, no, sorry. TF2 had problems. This is the problem that I feel that people don't understand is that this is a triple A game. Now, today, triple A games are made to the bone on budget. On budget. And people who are making them are being sweated out with the amount of work that they have to do to get this product out on time. And they have deadlines. This is what annoys me about some communities in the gaming world. They feel that their product should be out now and it should be as beautiful and perfect as the Mona Lisa. Well... Uh, Sometimes you cannot get that kind of excellence. Now, I'm going to stop the video here. Uh, please check out my um, end slate. See if you like it. Thank you very much for watching. Goodbye. Wait, well, let me die first. I know I'm going to complete another fool of myself in this bit. My idea was alright, but I wasn't quite understanding what I was doing. Because I was... There was somebody behind me, I think, if I'm correct. No, no, I did even be well in this, didn't I? I don't know why I died here. I died. Hmm. Yes, I did reasonably well here, didn't I? <laughs> Even though I've got to admit I've never had a bad game of Battlefield 4. Ooh, video just jumped for me. It probably didn't jump for you. I do class Battlefield 4 as a brilliant game. Is it an improvement over Battlefield 3? Yes, it really is. Ooh, that was a good, that was a good killing streak, I've got to say. That was a good kill streak. So, thank you very much for watching. Goodbye.